Hmm. Did Apple just upgrade the camera? A good six months ago when the iPhone 12 Pro Max came out, I was really excited. I was excited for the bigger sensor, the larger pixels, and of course, Pro Raw. And this was going to be a really big deal, especially with what we do here on this channel, taking photos with our phones in really low light. It was a huge game changer for iPhones. We're getting out there taking photos of the galactic core. You just couldn't do it on an iPhone before now. Not really that good. And then other phones came out. You see, I used to get photos like this. And sure, it wasn't any sort of Samsung S21 Ultra or, or any Android for that matter when you've got nice, perfect manual controls. It was a huge game changer for iPhones. We're getting out there taking photos of the galactic core. You just couldn't do it on an iPhone before now. Not really that good. And then other phones came out. But for an iPhone, it was good. It was really good. I would carry this phone as my daily carry. And then time went on and I was out there taking photos with the Galaxy and with the Pixel and with the P40 Pro. And this bad boy never really got much of a run at night anymore because the others were just so bloody good at it. And then something weird happened. I was out a couple of weeks ago and I took some photos with the iPhone 12 Pro Max when I was out there taking photos with some of the other phones. And when I got them back and I downloaded them onto the computer, I went, hold on, that's from an iPhone. Where'd that come from? All of a sudden, Apple got good. Apple got really good. Got so good. Well, let me show you. A few months ago, I was taking photos like this with the iPhone. Now, I'm taking photos like this. So what do we think has changed? What has made this better? And it's a lot better. No idea. I've got no idea what's caused this. I've looked through all the release notes of all the iOS updates that have happened in the last few months and I can't see anything that specifically relates to the change that I'm seeing in this phone. Maybe it's learning what to do. It's not unheard of. Phones, technology, learn from what we do. Maybe that's what's happening here. I'm genuinely curious if you've got an idea as to what's happened here, because it is like monumentally better. It's probably not quite as good as a uh, S21 Ultra because that thing is just the duck's nuts as far as astrophotography for phones go. But it's getting close. It's really, really close. There's been lots of rumors around iPhone 13. Is it gonna have an astrophotography mode? The rumors kind of come and go when it comes to that sort of thing, but. Who knows, it might be getting ready for something like that. I haven't seen any major update, like I say, that's caused this to happen. Let me know down the bottom what you think has caused this. If you want to see these two photos, I'll put them over there on phonephotoschool.com.au. You can download them and have a look for yourself. I'm genuinely curious as to what you guys think has actually caused this. Hope you guys have enjoyed a little bit of a tour through my house. We've got some of my artwork, some of the photos that I've taken over my years as a photographer in the background of some of this video, just so you guys can see what I've done. Anyway, I'll see you guys next week. Catch you later. The blackbird inside your chest That calls on you to cry You decided it was time